Hi everyone. So I've been really busy in my kitchen this week creating some Chinese recipes for Blue Dragon. So I thought I'd show you how to make this yummy sweet and sour stir fry with steamed vegetables using my new bamboo steamer set. But I couldn't just stop there. So if you check my link below, you'll also find one of my favorite recipes, some pork Chinese barbecue lettuce wraps, that's a mouthful, or some stuffed mushrooms with cheese on top, perfect party food, drizzling of chili sauce, and a delicious beef black bean noodle soup. But let's get cracking with the stir fry today. So this is my cool new bamboo steamer set by Blue Dragon. They didn't send me this, I actually found it in a charity shop for £3. I just couldn't resist and I've never used one before so I was pretty damn excited. And it came with two cool chopsticks. It's pretty much like a pan steamer but you use it in a wok. And this is my happy dance with a bottle of wine. So it should sit on a wok and pour some boiling water in and make sure you reach to the very top of the bottom layer. Don't overfill it. You just need to see the water just poking through and keep plenty of boiling water at hand as well because you'll need to top it up in a bit. So I used two large chicken breasts, probably used some smaller ones, mine came from a butcher, and place each one on top of some kitchen foil and wrap it up nice and tight so it's snug as a bug in a rug. They were pretty much the size of big baked potatoes, fancy. And then pop them in the middle of your steamer, not the top one as it seems here. I actually changed mine later on. So the closer the steamer is, the better it will cook. And pop that on medium heat. You don't want it boiling over. You'll probably run out of water too quick. And cook that for 15 minutes. And I'm just having a peek, just so my chicken is definitely progressing well. Yeah, looks like it is. And stack the steamer back on top and top it up with more boiling water to what you had right from the start. And now I'm adding 100 grams of broccoli florets and 50 grams of chanterelle carrots. You can just use regular sliced carrots, but I wanted to be fancy, it was my new toy. And pop the lid on top, and pop it on medium heat again, and cook that for eight minutes. And once it's done, it's time to take the chicken out. You'll need a tea towel, trust me, it was really hot. And carefully remove the chicken from the foil, and start slicing your chicken into bite-sized pieces. I had so much here. And then I know a little fella who will never say no to chicken juices. Tasty. And then we're gonna reuse your wok, so you'll need to clear it and add some oil in there. I always use an oil spray because it's healthier. And then add a thinly sliced red pepper and a shallot. And then your steamed vegetables and fry that on high heat for about two minutes and then add your chicken and fry for about another one. And check out my new apron, I love this. It's got little sauce holders as well. And then for the magic ingredient, which is sweet and sour Blue Dragon Wok Sauce. If you can't find these in your regular supermarket, which I'd be surprised if you can't, but you can actually get them on Amazon Pantry. And give that a really good stir and fry it for about two minutes until everything's coated and then just cook your rice. I've had a rice disaster. It's so messy. And it's as simple as that. It was really tasty. We had ours with spring rolls because it was Valentine's Eve. And uh, I'll leave uh, some other recipes below. And don't forget, if you like these recipes, there'll also be a printable version in my blog link below. And if you want to see more, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe. And hopefully I'll see you next Friday. Thanks for watching. Bye!